Hello, nice you dwarves, Antonio Gagaya, and Void Dweller. Welcome back to the Legend of Heroes Trails from Zeros. Last time we had lots of fun going through different costumes and finding people's wedding rings. And oh my god. <laughs> Woo! Oh my god, that was so fucking funny. You guys. And now. We have to go through certain things three times to see how everybody does it. So first, oh, we can actually sleep here if we want, I just realized. First it is Rendi Orlando. Time to go on in. And I hope, uh, oh wow, look how beautiful it is at night. Oh my god. Next game, hopefully, we can go into freaking public domain expansion land, uh, freaking, uh, properly. And have Tio have her amusement park, ex park experience, the ch experience that she deserves. I'm ready to go, man. Time to hit the road, Jack? Uh -huh. Yeah, let's go. Enter the Schwartz auction. I I, I want to do Lord Panada's glasses. I want to see them all. I want to see them all, doors. First things first. Let's try to get into the auction. Let's roll, Audio. Lloyd, Randy, you're going into precarious situation. Please be careful. Uh, you, Doris, can you tell me at like at a certain point, like when, like there's no re no more real differences, so I can switch over to the next person. We'll wait in the nearby area, just like we planned. If anything comes up, please contact us on your enigmas. Of course. You guys make sure to be cautious too. Sonja, Let's get this party started. Heads up, Lordy boy. You're out to see the old Randy Orlando in full power. <laughs> Can't wait. Don't get too cocky though. We're here on a job. Hell yeah. I am 100% focused on... Uh, what were we doing again? Randy? Uh, <laughs> just a joke. Welcome to the Schwartz Auction. May I see your invitation? Of course. Here you are. Lord handed over the invitation to whom he assumed was a mafioso. There you go. For security reasons. Could you please give the, gives us your names for verification purposes? Names? Oh, oh god. Uh, 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 Boyd Lannings. Oh my god. That's risky. Some people could know him. Oh boy. Oh wow. Whew. I'm uh <sighs> I'm Guy Vanix. I presume it's not mandatory to use my real name, is it? Huh. No, that won't be necessary. And you guessed? Ah what do I <laughs> Yo! I've been this guy's bird ever since we were texts. <laughs> I'll let you in on a little secret. This guy's way too uptight. This guy's way too uptight. I had to do a lot of convincing to get him go to the shindig with me. 
I'm hoping he can let loose and live a little for once. <laughs> uh, I would appreciate it if you didn't talk about me like that in front of them. <laughs> I see. Well, I must agree with your friends. It will be an experience unlike many others. Also, <laughs> also, I'm not as naive as you make me out to be. I didn't come here just. <coughs> I didn't come here just because you kept pestering me about it. I just thought this would pr provide me with some good real world experience for my future endeavors. Yeah, yeah, no need to get all worked up about it. Hey, I hear there's some real nice stuff I've ever been there. <laughs> Are the goods gonna live up to that? That sounds rather omin ominous. What is it, some kind of weapon? Some, like, black ornament or something? Black materia? Oh, boy. Oh, then there's no need to worry about that. Hello, Trance. Welcome to the stream. Well, then, Master Bannings and honored guests. It is our utmost wish that you enjoy tonight's auction to the fullest. Music is really cool. I love when we get to do stuff like this in RPGs. What kind of place do we step into? Damn, this mansion straight up cra cur crazy. <laughs> All things so rich even puts our Bonian nobles to shame. Yeah. This place is even fancier than I'd imagined. Speaker Hartman and Ravache. You're more influential than I even thought. Dear guests. Welcome to the Schwartz auction. Is this your first time attending? That's right. That's right. The auction is scheduled to begin at 9 p.m. inside the main hall, straight ahead. Until then, please enjoy a few drinks in the salon over through the door on the left. If you are hungry, food is available as well. <laughs> now that we're just gonna get our hair done. Not that these flowing locks need any help. <laughs> If you don't mind me asking, are you planning on staying the night with us? No. Yeah. Oh, uh, no. You see, I have a hotel for my You see, we've already booked a room at the Hotel Delfina. And have friends waiting for us there. Hello, Rox is welcome to, this, welcome to the stream. We appreciate the offer, 
But we'll have to pass this time. Very well. If you change your mind, please do not hesitate to inform one of the attendants. We'll prepare a room straight away. Also, you are more than welcome to stroll around the estate as much as you'd like. However, please be aware that there are a few restricted areas. We apologize for the inconvenience in advance. That shouldn't be an issue. Hey, thanks for letting us know, man. Yeah. My pleasure. If you need anything or have any complaints, please make sure to inform me or one of the other attendants. Now, if you'll excuse me. We have roughly two hours before the auction gets underway. Let's scope out the mansion for now. Sounds like a plan, my man. We even grab Bud T while we're looking around. My wife is usually extremely shy. In order to break her out of her shell, I decided to bring her along. If she's going to survive in high society, It'll be important for her to learn how to handle events like this. <laughs> this is the first time my husband has put me along to the Speaker's Mansion. The anticipation for this auction is killing me. I do hope we will able to be able to win something. My mansion back in the Empire is nothing to scoff at. But this place blows mine out of the water. <laughs> now this is what you'd call luxurious. Is that is that about the extent of unique stuff? Oh wow, this place is huge. Oh god. Oh, something's going on here. It's just a great big misunderstanding, okay? This woman is a colleague of mine, that's all. You can't fool me. I thought you were acting suspicious, and it seems I was right. Did you have the gall to come here with another woman? Hold on one second, I just need to... Uh... Hold on one second, I need to check something out. Alright, sorry about that, just checking on Coco. Things are okay. 
Just being her usual self. Uh, it, it's not worth it to, okay. So uh, after I get into the entrance, I'll just do this scene with Randy and Lloyd and uh, after I get into the entrance, I'll just uh, uh, do and just continue with Ellie for the rest of it. If you guys say it's not worth it. Hello, Oddjars. Welcome to the stream, by the way. Hey, I see you're able to sneak inside with relative ease. Well, thanks to you. What exactly is uh, going on here? <laughs> oh, you know. Just your run of the mill crumbling marriage. <laughs> you want to talk? After all, you just brought in some strange boy here with you. No, don't tell me. You have that kind of relationship with him? Yeah, I will do Tio for the entrance, too. I will. I will. This young man soothed my troubled heart in my time of need. I love you, no. After I first came to Crossbell, I was lost and confused. It was also unfamiliar to me. But Wazi came to my rescue. Even offered to be my escort here to the auction, so I wouldn't have to come all on my lonesome. Hello, children, Chathaka and Minotaur, welcome to the stream. Our relationship is nothing like the no doubt salacious one you have here with that trollop. Uh. <laughs> 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 I'd be more than happy to make this something more, Evelyn. I have a proposition. <laughs> wow! Oh my god, this guy's crazy. How about you ditch your heartless husband and make love to me? Oh my god! Oh my god! I can't deny that adorably feisty ladies like yourself have a certain charm to them. What? I could never. You! How about you go and try to pull your moves on someone else's wife, pal? I'm not your pal, buddy. I'm not your buddy, guy. Uh, I think I've had enough of this. <laughs> James, if you want to have an affair. Be smarter about it next time. Ah, <sighs> guess I'll have to see if I can learn some other rich fool while I'm here. Nikita! Nikita! Wait! <laughs> I think that was obvious. So I was right. That nonsense about her being a colleague was all a lie, after all. I'm fed up with your crap. If this is how things are, I'd rather go live with my parents again. Evelyn, hold on. Hey, nobody ever said marriage was a walk in the park. I think we're gonna head out now, Wazi. <laughs> I can't say I blame you. Enjoy the party, you two. Oh, that was great. That was hilarious. 
Oh man, okay, this is just a full room on its own. Let's just talk to everybody here and then I will switch to uh Tio. Well, I'll meet up with you two later. This little fuss might drag on for a while. So I decided to try to defuse the whole thing. What? What, did you suddenly grow a conscience, Mr. Dishartle's husband, to make love to me? Looking at them, it seems you'll ever work cut out for you, so, uh, good luck. <laughs> Evelyn, please wait. This is all my fault. Every bit of it. Please, just don't leave me. Nikita, she tempted me into taking her. How can you stand right there and lie to my face? Have you no shame? I can't take this anymore. You better believe your mother will hear about this, James. No, please, anything but that. <laughs> oh, man. Their argument is making me nervous. And I never clean well when I'm nervous. I doubt I'll be able to mediate this fight, considering the tense atmosphere. I suppose I have no choice but to give up cleaning until this storm blows over. Okay, there we go. Alright, now let's load. Load for Tio. And we'll just see Tio's entrance. God damn it, I keep forgetting which way to go. I believe I am as ready as I will ever be. Should we go now? Uh -huh. Yeah, let's go. Lloyd put on his pair of glasses. First things first. Let's try to get into the auction. Roger. Lloyd, Tio, there's still a lot of unknown factors. Please be careful. We'll be hanging out around this area like we planned. If anything comes up, give us a call on your enigmas. Of course. You guys make sure to be cautious too. So then, let's We will be off then. Welcome to the Schwartz auction. May I see your invitation? Nah. Alright, everything with uh, Lloyd will just skip over. Names? Uh, I'm, uh, I'm Guy Banks. I presume it's not mandatory to use my real name, is it? Lloyd? Uh, I mean, uh, Guy? No, that won't be necessary. And your guests? Um, Guy. She said Nisama, so he's playing her older brother. Do I really have to tell this strange man my name? Yeah. No, that shouldn't be necessary. This young lady is my little sister. Is that going to be a problem? Yeah, 
No, of course not. Tada, a mari ni terasaranai go kyo dai desu ne. Again with this. My sister and I do not resemble each other in any way except for hair color. <laughs> like, even like the type of hair. Like, she has straight hair and I have curly hair. Like, seriously. <laughs> it, it, it doesn't have to be a thing. Forgive my rudeness, but you two oddly resemble each other. Of course we don't. Tio, you're up here thinking of a whole goddamn backstory. <laughs> My mother recently married his father, so we are not blood related. Oh my god, Tia, why are you doing this? Why why is that the why is that the first place you go? <laughs> because of that, we could even get married ourselves if we wanted. God damn it, Tio! No, bad. <laughs> what am I gonna do with you? You're not old enough to be worrying about marriage. <laughs> anyway, as you see, though we're not siblings by birth, we're family all the same. <laughs> On a different note, my sister here has some of the sharpest jazz I know. I brought her along in order to help me size up some of the items that'll be for up for auction tonight. Hello, Hollow Mirage, welcome to the stream. <laughs> I won't let you down, guy. <laughs> you don't see siblings as you get along as well as every day. Well, the master Bannings and his sisters. <laughs> I love that talk and I read Tilrin's comment. Unlike me, I need glasses. <laughs> says Lloyd. <laughs> Hi, Jean. There's our utmost wishes that you enjoy tonight's auctions to the fullest. The overall atmosphere reminds me of a castle than a mansion. I cannot fathom how much mirror it must cost to maintain it. Yeah, this place is even fancier than I imagined. Speaker Hartman. Okay. Thank you for the information. Roger that. Okay, okay. You know what would have been funnier if he said, uh, my name is, uh, Guy uh, Mannings. Yeah, that's right. Guy Mannings. Mr. Guy Mannings. A very, very completely unfake name, I see. <laughs> okay, now let's do the real one.
And I make the same mistake three times in a row. <laughs> All right, there we go. Now let's do this for reals. I'm ready if you are, Lloyd. Shall we get going? Yeah, let's go. Hello, Trancer. Welcome to the stream. Lord Pinata's hair glasses. Hello, boy Traveler. Welcome to the stream. First things first, let's try to get into the auction. We can do it. Lloyd, Ellie, you're going into a precarious situation. Please be careful. We'll be hanging around out around this area like we planned. If anything comes up, give us a call on your uniqueness. Of course. You guys make sure to be cautious too. I think it's time, Lloyd. God, I just finished watching the whole first season of Spy X Family. <laughs> so, uh. I am very much in the mood for things like this. <laughs> It's even more ironic that that his fake name in there is Lloyd. <laughs> Welcome to the Schwartz Auctions. Alright, yeah, we've been through this. Names? Names? Uh, I'm a guy. I can't even. I'm a. I'm. Uh. I'm. Guy Bennings. Really, Lloyd? I. Uh, guy. I presume it's not mandatory to use my real name, is it? Oh, that is so cool, Doris. No, that won't be necessary. I've heard that uh, the person Persona 3 remake is good. <laughs> All right, Ellie, here's your chance. Show Lloyd that you can actually act. Here we go! Aren't you boys working hard? <laughs> Unfortunately, I can't exactly reveal my name in this setting. That won't be a problem, will it? Well, no. Still, do you mind informing us of your relationships with this gentleman? Oh boy, here we go, 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 here we go! Oh, I don't Oh, we don't look like lovers to you. Not a bit. <laughs> oh my god, she was enjoying every second of this! To be more specific, we are in the middle of a passionate relationship that I've yet to tell mother and father about. Although that part is actually true, because we're not in one and I haven't told them yet. I have no idea where my mom is. <laughs> Forgive me, dear. I've caused you all this trouble because of my social status. It is not a single worry, Guy. 
でもきっと事業を成功させてご両親にお嬢さんをくださいって頼めるように頑張るから However I will work tirelessly in order to stand before your parents and ask them for their beloved daughter's hand in marriage I mean Yes You really are quite cute Oh dear. I await that day with bated breath. Oh, oh, my apologies is for risking. Well, then, Mr. Bannings and uh, guests. It is our utmost wish that you enjoy our tonight's auctions to the fullest. It is. God, I got a whole evening of doing this! <laughs> if only you could do this every single night! Oh my god! Okay, Ellie, stay focused on the mission. Don't get distracted by Lloyd's. Gorgeous face framed by those adorable glasses! <laughs> what kind of place did we step into? So, this is Speaker Hartman's mansion. I've heard the rumors, but I didn't expect it to be this grand. Yeah. This place is even fancier than I'd imagined. Oh my god. Imagine if Lloyd just takes me in front of a place with fireworks and outside garden and just asks me to marry him right then and there. I think I would say yes for Leo! Uh, Ellie, what'd you say? <laughs> I mean, oh yes, Guy. This place is rather elegant, don't you think? That didn't sound anything like that. This place is rather elegant, don't you think? Uh, yes. Speaker Hartman and Revache. More influential than I ever thought. Dear guest, blah blah blah, I'm going to say the same thing over and over. Yes, yes, Thank you for the explanation. Yeah. My pleasure, blah 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 Yes, of course. I would be completely understanding of that boy. <laughs> Alright, let's just quickly go through the Wazi scene. Because we already saw this with Randy. It's, I, I, like, uh, I don't think the second person even says much here. Let's just get through this so we, um... Oh god, I missed Ellie. Alright, we have one dialogue, but okay. As James told me he would win the jewelry at the auction, but so much for that. Now I have to find another lonely guest, but I still can! Tsh, typical man. Okay, there is a text log. If James actually used his head, this could have been avoided. I guess I better search for some other lonely fool before the auction starts. No, B or K both do nothing.
I can't see. Oh, interesting. I just, uh, clicking the central mouse button is the same as clicking F. Well, let's save the garden. I doesn't do it either. No, nor does you. <laughs> Keep thinking of letters. I'll get it eventually. No, it's not you. It's J. We um probably don't want to get involved here. Look at that spread. There really are a lot of party guests, too. Alright, bye, doors. All the food and drinks here look so extravagant. They must have hired the best chefs money can buy for all of this. I'd love to try them out if this were in any if we were in any other situation. But honestly, thanks to my nerves, I don't have much of an appetite. I can't blame you there. Oh, so cute! They're so cute! <laughs> I am so glad I am picking these two to go through it for reals. Oh my god. Okay, view the following. Now I can actually use the guide because it finished updating the, the freaking... My phone was updating Honkai Star Rail for 13 gigs for the big update. But now it's done, I can finally look at the guide. Ah, uh, jeez. Alright, west side, one floor room. Okay. And then 2F and 4F. Alright, let's go talk to everybody here. Speaker Herman's names are supposedly carried quite a lot of influence with the Empire. Why could someone use this opportunity to get into his good graces? My future will be set. Ha! Those men in black suits working security, they're from Revachain Go, aren't they? That Marconi is deep within Speaker Herman's pocket. That much is clear. Hm. I'll show him. Laptops like Marconi get tossed aside the moment they make a single mistake. Oh, you look like you have a unique sprite almost. Thanks, Jusaka. What phone company? Optus. Same as the internet. It would appear you aren't very well accustomed to auctions like this. Am I correct? <laughs> well, be careful. The excitement that comes from fighting a bidding war can be positively addicting. Every time I come to Crossville, I'm reminded of just how laughably incompetent police department is. I swear, especially that SSS should stand for suck, suck, suck. I mean, they're not even able to shut down something as clearly illegal yet widely known as this auction. Rose just speaks to is Speaker Hartman's absolute authority over this state. <laughs> Damn it. I'm sorry, Lloyd. Apparently, the centerpiece of the auction is being kept secret. I can only assume it is something of immense value. 
Perhaps it's something stolen by that phantom thief B. Well, we know he's here. Hmm. You look rather young. And be given an invite to an event like this. You must either be a noble or a very wealthy individual. If you don't mind, you can tell me a little about your background. Uh, about that? <laughs> Nervous, are you? No wonder, giving her age. I suppose a bit of faux pas to ask such a question in a place like this. Please accept my apologies, young man. Yeah, the food looks great. <coughs> Asmelis ring? Like Asmelis tower? Here. Have a nice long look at the Asmelis ring I won last year. Is it simply not beautiful? This young widow wings with the combatant splendor. It is said that Speaker Hartman has connection with the rebellious blood and iron chancellor. I guess that's to be expected from a man descendant of imperial nobility. His company is going to be the same as a commoner's. Imad is here! Oh, and there's Kilika. Oh, what do we have here? I know I've seen those two faces before. <laughs> Imelda! Why in the world are you here? Well, an invitation found its way to my doorstep. Curiosity bid me to come. Shady old lady, as always. Uh, if you don't mind, could you... Oh, don't worry. I don't intend to snitch. <coughs> Knowing that you're here, sneak around a place crawling with some unsavory people is quite amusing for this old woman. Oh. Oh. Ah. Kirika san? Kirika? What a surprise. I can't say I was expecting to run into you two here. Well, we were just in the neighborhood and. Uh... <coughs> Sorry. It's a long story. <laughs> Ha, ah, jeez. Well, I won't press the issue. So, what name should I use to address you two at this event? What? How did you know? Well, we're going to Considering your affiliation, it's not hard to guess why you're here. Blood is supposed to provide your name when you hand over your invitation at the door. So, how should I address you? Uh, you can call me Guy. <laughs> Very well, Guy. You can keep calling me Kilika. Alright. So, what brings you to the Schwartz auction, Kilika? Interested in bidding on something? <laughs> Given the nature of my job, I've come to miss my fair share of collectors. So, 
And so they request I inspect what kind of goods are being auctioned off here. Ma, Shijo Chosa to Ittako, ne? Market research, if you will. Naruhodo. Got it. Shikashi, Haruto Mangi Cho to Yuhitova, Nakanaka Nukemena Jimbus no yo, ne? You know that speaker Hartman strikes me as quite the shrewd character. This auction structure is very finely crafted. Finely crafted? What do you mean? Keshte Tekihat Sadeu Kotononai, Joru Kaiku Boyotashino, Urano Auction. Think about it. An unknown underground auction designed exclusively for the elite? Sodewa. That's quite the convenient meeting place for prominent figures across the moor. Tanar Tohi Gaimo, Wairo no Shinaya, Shikin Cho that's not a man of Yokonara Shihi. And there's more than just smuggled goods being sold here. The bribery material, illicit fundraiser items, and who knows what else. So there are Jiko de Shogu and Shioto Sereba, who it's near the Kiatsu and Manuarena. If said figures try to unload all these items in their own countries, they wouldn't be able to avoid the lost notice for long. Demo, Kono Kurosubiri de Aninakata Kotoni Saratishima. However, here in Crossbell, such activity is allowed to go on unimpeded. Yeah. Dakarakoso, Teiko Kumo Kyoa Kokumo, Kono Okso Mokuni Stiru. That is exactly why the Empire and the Republic have turned a blind eye to the short auction. I expect there's a number of questionable pieces that will be presented tonight. Including items of dubious provenance that both countries were willing to part with for the right price. <laughs> In other words, this is an unofficially sanctioned international black market. When you put it like that, it really is terrible. Of course, one could claim such an arrangement is only possible in places such as Crossbell. This may be a hard truth to swallow, but... Going against this will be an uphill battle. Wait. Tada, you could take it away, but I don't Yet. No matter how finely crafted this arrangement may be, it remains an unnatural creation. Huh? She encapsulates everything around us, ever flowing in harmony. Distorted constructs will always be as such, and so they are fleeting and impermanent. One tiny thing could be enough to make the whole foundation fall apart. What I mean to say is that perhaps your efforts will not be in vain. Kirika-san. Kirika? So it is reassuring to hear you say that. It appears I've taken up quite a bit of your precious time. This is a rare opportunity. You should take in everything you possibly can tonight. I'm sure that it will serve you well in the days to come. Hi. Yes, ma'am. Tonight's dinner party was hosted and funded by Mr. Hartman, entirely out of the kindness of his heart. On his behalf, please feel free to eat you to your heart's content. Let's see. 
Each dish presented tonight in an unmatched delicacy, prepared by the mansion's very own chef. Please feel free to stop me if you need anything at all. Oh, right now it's time to go upstairs. Oh. Otto? Is that... Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, we're gonna meet Speaker Hartman. The sponsor of tonight's event has arrived and would like to reach you all. Oh, Mafia. Those two. Yes. Ruffishay's Dawn and Speaker Hartman. Good morning, everyone. I am Makoni, president of Ravishay and Co. and sponsor of this cherished auction. By my count, this is our eighth annual auction! My, does time sure fly! I'm happy to announce that the attendance increases with every year! And, of course, we've expanded our lineup of auction exhibits to account for that. Everything you see before you is the fruit of your continued patronage. The night is yours, my guests. <laughs> There is uh, still one other thing that must be addressed. Every year without fear, one man graciously hosts us in our auction at this breathtaking mansion. I present to you a representative of Crossbell State, a powerful politician within our day. Speaker Hardman, everyone! Ooh, he's got a... He's got a Dio voice. Though previously mentioned, allow me to introduce myself once more. I am Hartman, the speaker of the Crossbell Diet. Is that is that Dio's voice actor? <laughs> It is a great honor to serve as your host and offer my humble home for tonight's festivities. It's not okay. Okay, it sounds a bit like him. Believe me, this is no ordinary auction. Famous individuals from a multitude of fields have come to socialize and mingle tonight. Remember, the night is still young. I have to pre prepared a modest after party for you all following the conclusion of the auction. For tonight, it would be my pleasure if you would all consider my home as your home. Really? He voices Olivier? Oh my god, I did not know that. 
Everyone, please enjoy yourself. So those are the two we've heard so much about. The speaker definitely has the air of a high-level politician. It's likely because he believes he has absolute authority over the state. Also, it's the first time I've ever seen Ravashi's dog. I get the feeling he's even more shrewd than we had originally thought. Yeah, they aren't going to be easy to go up against. I don't know if I'm to go up I'd like to speak with them, but I doubt that'd be a smart move right now. I agree. I have actually met the speaker on a few occasions. Oh no! It would be best to avoid direct contact if possible. Agreed. Let's try to sneak out of the salon without attracting much attention. Alright, so west side, top floor. And east side, second floor. Okay. Here's all the events. West side, top floor. Wait. Oh, we can go, to, we can have a little more. Ladies and gentlemen, the auction will be starting shortly. And with that, our friends will become our rivals. Let us take the time to deepen our bonds with friends and partners until it's time. Tonight, we intend to present you fine men and women some extraordinary goods. I wish each and every one of you the best of luck in winning what you desire. Speaker Hartman of the Imperial Faction and Ravishenko's Don Marconi. I'd like to speak with them to gauge what kind of people they are, but I think it would be best to step away for now. And the boss and Speaker Harden seem like they're in a good mood. But luck, they'll stay that way. Alright. So, uh, let me, let's check out the, all the other floors here. Oh my god. Alright, this is the second floor event. Oh my god! Oh my god, look at me! I'm gonna get a, get a shippy seat! Look at this! Oh my god! Nah, Eddie. Lloyd, I fucking swear! Lloyd Bannings. Lloyd Bannings. I fucking swear, if you're going to Lloyd this up. Oh god, I am just. <laughs> hey, Ellie? Call you sets me or can I need scrutiny? Don't know, could I know Mira got to you that all more? About how much mirror do you think it took to build all of this? What is that? I'm not sure if I could even put a price on it, honestly. I doubt many castles would have this sort of decor either. <sighs> Who are you? Oh god, hey, it's oh hello. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, it's you. Here to freaking be a cock blocker, I see. God damn. <sighs> What's with Speaker Hartman? 
そこまでの資産家なのか I know he's from nobility, but is he really that wealthy? Oh, what's up, guys? Dress up, Yeah, 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 yeah. その格好で言われても。You want to talk。さすがにラフすぎる格好だと思いますけど。Agreed。I don't really think your outfit is appropriate for this event。ハルトマンのおっさんも自分の家のようにくつろげとか言ってたからな。Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. I've been told us to make ourselves at home, so that's exactly what I'm doing. Wearing cross bell, etc., etc. あんたらもぼちぼち楽しんでるようで何よりだ。But enough about my clothes. You guys look like you're having fun. ま、俺に比べたらまだまだだけどな。Well, a long way to go before you're able to have as much fun as me! <laughs> oh my god! What? <sighs> Let's see here. <laughs> I think I found the sweet spot. What are you doing? Unbelievable. Do you actually expect to catch a fish here? Oh, oh. Oh, oh! Stacksa! Come to Papa! Srechata. Did he just. Eus! Kyoa Nakanaka Imogasrena! Whoa! I believe that's what the pros call a beaut. Mmm! Koreba Kuroe no Miyagani Motitero. I'm sure Noir will appreciate something like this. If I remember correctly, that kind of goldfish is typically kept and displayed in high class establishments. Wait, are you really just gonna take it? Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. What happens at the auction stays at the auction. But you literally just said you're taking it with you! <laughs> See you later, guys! Good luck. I'll be able to figure out something this nice yourselves. Huh? Let's just pretend we didn't see anything. Now we spoiled the goddamn mood! And no fishing spot. God damn it, that would have been amazing. That would have been amazing. Mind if we just walk into your hotel room here? This auction is the perfect opportunity to forge new connections with influential people from all over Zamori. <laughs> My dear sweet daughter, I hope we find you a good husband while you were here, eh? <laughs> now, father, oh, I think you just want to use me to make some new friends. Now that I think about it, isn't a political marriage the only reason you were adopted into mother's family? <laughs> you got me there! Yes, just ignore us. We're just here to listen in. 
eavesdrop on everybody. Despite most hiding their real names, you will invite to this event all powerful individuals from both Empire and Republic. Politicians and nobles are quite skilled at swapping up personas for each and every circumstance. Of course, that includes me too. <laughs> Swapping out personas, yep! The power of the wild card. I'm not in much of a mood for the buffet. May I surely taste the best one you have made, serve them to you. Anything less just can't measure up. I managed to get an invitation from an acquaintance of mine. I'm not sure if I belong in this kind of environment. I think I'm just going to wait here until the auction starts. And these are the four person rooms. My husband adores dolls more than anything, almost anything in the world. At first I found his fascination with them a bit childish, but since then I've got to truly appreciate their beauty. They have a charm to them that just pulls you right in. As long as they don't kill me in the middle of the night, I suppose. Ooh, a doll. Is it going to be Pater Mater? Oh, boy. Rumor has it that I highlighted tonight's auction with was exquisitely crafted doll. When I hear that, I can only assume it's the work of the Rosenberg Studio. Oh, I can't wait until this finally starts. Excuse me, sir. Oh, yeah, that's right, the battle dolls. Oh, yeah, the shonen puppets. Yeah, that was awesome. This is the owner's personal room. You mean speaker heart? Quite so, sir. Of course, Mr. Hardman is currently absent. He will soon be at the salon, where, which is on the left-hand side of the first floor. Uh, right. I saw him not too long ago. If you'll excuse us. Alright, and we have to go to the other uh, floor four. And I think we're good. Yeah, doll night, yeah. I'm terribly sorry, sir. But I can't let you throw here. This room is for staff only. Oh, uh, sorry. We got a little overwhelmed by the size of this place and lost our way. So the Mafia is guarding this part. I'm guessing then Marconi is... Hey! Everything's sorted like it says in the list, right? Oh, that's where they're keeping the auction items, I think. Yeah, it's almost time to carry the goods for the first air fail. Oh, son of a... By any chance, are the pieces being stored in there? Correct. We've been keeping a watchful eye over them so things can run as smooth as possible tonight. You can look forward to seeing everything once the auction begins. 
Of course. I wouldn't miss it for the world. Ready to head back? Yes, shall we? Oh my god! <laughs> Who is saying this? Huh? Who is who is this? Lloyd? Yeah. Go man. Not the night. Oh, it's nothing. Ayaka Koko Hanario. Let's just hurry and get out of here. Alright, and that's uh that's our cue to start the auction. Let's just put a save here. The call of destiny, it sure seems like it. Oh boy. Just one second. Let's see. I just, uh, it feels like something big is gonna happen at the auction. After going through the main hall, go to the side hallways and go back in the middle. Okay. Oh, wow. I thought this was like going through the middle was gonna start everything huge. All right. Well, let's go to the middle then. Let's get it started. Oh, wait, the auction hasn't started yet. Nobody's in here. Oh, there he is. There's Lecter talking to a cat. There's Burn Castle. Apparently, this is where the actual auction is being held, but. Place is so over the top. Is that really an indoor waterfall? Yeah, they expected you to go here first. It's kind of misleading. <laughs> the way they say because it, it feels like they're saying like go in here to start the main story and like everywhere else is side content go in here to start the main story is what it sounded like he said is that really an indoor waterfall I haven't seen anything this lavish in my entire life well, let's just head somewhere else for now. Oh my god, I got... Yeah, they totally meant for you to come here first. I still want to see for, for myself the kinds of people invited to such an underground event such as this. Oh, well, we can talk to everyone here. How do we even get to these side seats? Oh, I see. No, I took a lot of time for you to catch your dinner here. But just go up this down and give me some things. Like the waterfall seems like it would be so noisy. How could they hear anything? Guys, look at you! She's much not that thing like there's no tomorrow. Hmm. Hopefully you won't get sick from eating that. I've never seen that species before, but oh well. I uh, gave the fish to his cat. Oh god. That poor cat. Oh my god. I have still a little time until the auction begins, dear guests. The main hall is still being prepared, so we appreciate if you could wait a little bit longer. 
Okay, I guess we can go here, but there's no reason to. Rocks here. The master's pet cat Elizabeth seems to have wandered off somewhere. Oh! Oh dear. I worried that she'll cause trouble for the rest of the guests. I'm very sorry. Due to the auction preparations, we ask you to refrain from getting on stage. So with the lots, the items up for auction are going to be presented. So we have to take many precautions to guarantee their safety. Now I save. And I'm just gonna get uh, a drink before we start the uh, sorry, start the auction.
All right, we're back. Let's get this started. Oh, there's Garcia. Uh, I wasn't expecting this. Take Chirinami to Shikoketaku. Ooh, does he know that we're here? I was sure they'll try to pull something stupid by now. Or is he talking about, um, Heiwei? Hmm. Not now the ordinary so far, boss. Yeah. yeah, he is talking about Heiwei. Besides, I even don't I don't even hate you way to put off something big enough to run it ruin Speaker Hartman's rep. Don't underestimate him, dumbass. Forget Yin. I've heard stories that this Sao guy has even got Heiwei's old guard on edge. If they catch you with your gun, Tom, you're as good as dead. Uh, hi. Sorry, boss. Sorry, boss. Anyways, something just feels off with this year's auction. I have a feeling that some of someone besides Heiwei is messing with us. That's what my gut says, at least. Really? Is that your Jaeger instincts talking? Sure, something like that. <laughs> or maybe I'm just getting old. I'd love if everything went off without a hitch. But I just can't shake this feeling. The same feeling I used to get before going out on a hunt. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> no. He's Garcia Rossi. Ah, my apologies. Garcia Rossi. My name is Garcia Rossi. I'm in charge of tonight's security detail. I was a part of that. I make sure to patrol this area every so often. Please forgive me for any inconvenience this may cause. Here. Oh, it's uh, no trouble at all. I can see you're all doing a great job. If we keep talking to him, he's bound to... Oh, shit. Why are you going out to him? Oh, thank God he's got the Clark Kent thing going on here. Hmm. Can't shake the feeling that we've met somewhere before, sir. Oh. I think it might just be your imagination. I doubt it forget meeting such a mountain of a man as yourself. <laughs> you may be right. Still, just to be safe. Do you mind telling me your name? No. Sure, I don't see why not. God damn it, Lloyd! Guy Bannings. Pleased to meet you, Mr. Rossi. Guy? Guy. 
God damn it! He probably killed him or something. Oh god. Someone thought that rings a bell. Crap. Did I screw up? Do you think, Lloyd? Jesus Christ. Do you freaking think? Why did you choose that? What should we do? <laughs> Sorry, I'm late. Oops. Oh, it's it's Bell. Okay. Huh? Bell? Bell? Good evening, Guy. Fancy meeting you in a place like this. Yeah, you too. Yes, quite unexpected. Uh, and who might you be, madam? I'm Maria Valcroix. A pleasure to meet you. IBC. Royce, as in the IBC. You have my sincerest apologies, Miss Croix. I was told you'd be attending. Ooh, is she gonna be like an, a guest party member? Oh, that'd be cool. I take it you finally decide to accept our invitation this year. Oh my god, that's true, Chisaka. Oh my god, she's gonna hate that he's pretending to be her boyfriend. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it would paint me in a bad light if I kept on refusing your kind offers. Also, these two guests are dear friends of mine. Is there some sort of problem here? Oh, of course not. Allow me the privilege of welcoming you to the Schwartz auction one more time. Would you like me to show you to where Speaker Hoffman is? <laughs> I will pay our beloved Speaker a visit here later. In the meantime. Did you have a room prepared for me? I've been in a business meeting with a good por a good portion of the day, and would love to get a good bit of rest. Very well. You would. Uh... Mrs. Croix would like a room prepared. You better watch yourself and treat her with the utmost respect. Alright? Yes, sir. Please, Mrs. Croix, allow me to show you to your room. That's <laughs> Ah, uh, so that's what's going on. Quite the bold move, guys. If you were actually her boyfriend, I would have to kill you. Yeah, well... I... Oh, sorry. I could see how it might seem like we're doing this for own self-satisfaction. Don't get me wrong. I like your idea. If you weren't as determined as you are, there is no way I would have let you be one of Ellie's co-workers. What 
あ、ちょっと待って。ちょっと待って。ちょっと待って。ちょっと待って。ちょっと待って。ちょっと待って。ちょっと待って。ちょっと待って。ちょっと待って。ちょっと待って。ちょっと待って。ちょっと待って。
for it to have ended up here. I don't know if it was stolen or some rich man had to part of it with it for some reason. But what I do know is that the rumors say it's an absolute masterpiece. As a collector, I can't let this chance pass me by, can I? That's true. You've been a fan of those dolls for as long as I can remember. Out of curiosity, how much does one of these dolls usually go for? So this one. Let me think. The studio's earlier works were much bigger than the ones now. They rarely show up in the market anymore. Yeah, she's totally talking about freaking robots. And given the fact that Dollmaker doesn't intend to make any of those like those again. They've racked up quite the premium. One was even sold for approximately 5 million Mira at an auction in Imperial Capital. One doll is that much? Well, given how passionate the fans are and how the dolls are truly priceless works of art, it's not that shocking. You're dead set of win winning this bid, aren't you, Phil? <laughs> oh, you know I am. Besides, regardless of how it ended up here, it's not that doll's fault. Of course, if it turns out it was stolen, I'll make sure to take the proper means. If it's a Verka, I would keep it. Doors. <laughs> That includes formally negotiating with the former owner to officially make it mine. How thorough. <sighs> You're dedicated, that's for sure. おめでとうございます。マリアベル様。ありがとう。I'll head back there in just a minute. So please prepare three seats, preferably in the back for us. Will you? It would be my pleasure. Uh, Belle? I know what you're thinking. And there's no need to worry. I'll wait until after the auction to introduce myself to the speaker. He won't see you. If that's the case... 
Shall we accompany our lord? Yeah. Might as well go together since we have the chance. Maria san Yoroshiko onigaishimasu. Thank you for setting up, us up with seats, Maribo. Oh, it was nothing. Oh my god, what is Coco doing? Oh, do we have her in our group? What? She's not even a support. Oh my god. Dang it. She's not even a support. I was really hoping we'd get some skills with her. Let's see if uh, the handy dandy strategy guide. Go back to the main lobby and in, in, in the auction room for an event. Okay. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah. I see. There's a back alley, Doctor Glenn. Oh my God. Oh my God. No limbus after this void, so don't worry about that. Yeah, we're gonna end soon. I, I can see there's a good place to stop. There's a good place to stop coming up very soon. Yeah, so let's go to the auction. I'm getting slightly tired, so I don't want to. I don't want to stream when I'm too tired. But yeah. But uh, so we're gonna end. Uh, there's a good stopping point coming up soon. So many wealthy people in one place. <laughs> well, I don't know. Like, there's plenty of people in this world that looks like they can probably fight. I assume she has some fighting ability. Some ornaments like she seems like she would. Yes, I get the feeling there'll be a tremendous amount of Mira being exchanged tonight. Maria Mrs. Croix. We have been awaiting your arrival. Are these seats to your liking? Yes, they will do. Thank you. Hello, Orange Hair. You're welcome to the stream. Shall we sit? Sure. That's true. She did lift up Lloyd with one hand. It's about to begin. I am starting to get nervous. All right, let's see. Oh, Wazi, hello. Ah, koko ni itanoka. And your gigantic ass. <laughs> Seriously, they had too much fun modeling his ass. The animators. <laughs> oh, so this is where you're hiding. I can't help but notice you're alone. How did that argument earlier turn out? Oh, you know how it goes. 
A little lover spat, and then there's them in each other's arms once more. And with that beautiful reunion, I was relieved of duty. Well, I'm glad for them at least. Wow, that's amazing they were able to resolve that. <laughs> I'm glad there was a happy ending. A friend of yours. He certainly seems like quite the character. Yeah. Mari, well, this guy is... Wazi. Wazi Hemisphere. Wazi. Wazi Hemisphere. IBC you are Miss Maribel Kreuz, aren't you? The daughter of the head of the IBC? It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Oh my! I'll have to stay on my toes around you, won't I? It's nice to meet you, Wazi. Shall I have someone prepare a seat for you? Yeah. No, that won't be necessary. Truth be told, I was hoping I could speak to these two for a second. Huh? When I looked down the courtyard from, from one of the windows, I saw a number of guard dogs that seemed to be sleeping. Any idea why that might be? Are you serious? Guard dogs? He must be talking about Rebushi's warhounds. But why would they be sleeping now of all times? Maria Berza. I'm sorry, Maribel. I think we're going to have to excuse ourselves for a little while. <laughs> Something interesting must be going on. Hmm. Well, don't let me hold you up. I'll stay here and keep an eye on what they're auctioning. Thank <laughs> That'll be great. Arigato, Thanks, pal. The guard dogs they put in the courtyard are all fast asleep. <laughs> now, what could that mean? It means someone is coming in to steal the auction stuff. Ah, Considering the situation... Um, I think it's the first one, but just in case. Yup! Yeah. Think it's likely there's an intruder in our midst. Oh, God damn it. Lloyd, you didn't say the line. You didn't say the line, Lloyd. Lloyd? Lloydy, come on, say the line. Oh, all right. There is an imposter among us. <laughs> I think so, too. In any case, something is definitely happening behind the scenes. That's the only thing we can say for sure. Let's make one more lap around the mansion just to be sure. We might notice something different. Let's go! <laughs> I'll be coming with you. That seems to be too fun to sit out. Are you gonna be in our party? Damn it! 
All right, go back into the auction and go backstage. Oh dear. Elizabeth seems to have become quite fond of one of the guests, a Mr. Arundel, I believe he was called. I was quite shocked given her usual unsociable attitude. I suppose stranger things have happened. There. We can finally mark the stage, check off our list. Found a book in the back. It's only probably dropped it last year. It doesn't look like that particular guest is with us this year, though. If you'd like it, I'd be more than happy to let you have it. Oh my god. How would anyone know this? Alright, yeah, so we're gonna get into some fights uh, soon to end the chapter. I'm going to, when we get to a healing room, is, uh, is what I'm gonna say. So let's just talk to, talk to the important people again. I'll sit here, I'll stay here and observe what items they put up for bed. I don't know if anything is gonna happen, but try to be careful. Oh, she's not here. All right, so I guess I'll just go where it tells me to go. Let's see. East side four of. Smat. No good. He's out cold. And looks like he was taken out with a single blow. Impressive. Who could do something like this? Let's go inside. Oh, hello! Yo! What did you get his? There she is. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm known as Yin. And now I can appear anywhere in the moonlight and shine. Cut the crap! Hurry up and die! Fools. Oh, she's gonna use her ultimate. Alright. <laughs> Unbelievables. What? Hi, Risha. I thought so. Oh, God damn it. I didn't know. Why did Killick have to move to the main hall? God damn it. I thought I sensed some particular presences. So y'all snuck in as well, huh? And you. Hey, huh. You seem like an especially dangerous fellow. So Let me guess. You're the famous Yin I've heard so much about. Rachiwar was a hemisphere. Leader of the Crossbell City's Testaments. So y'all were one of the odd, odd presences I sensed. <laughs> and there are yet more here as well. 
His auction truly is a lion's dance. Mm -hmm. Huh. Me? Odd. What a funny thing to say. So did so you, do you plan to dispose of us just as swiftly as you did then? Wait, what? <laughs> Despite it being simpler to deal with y'all here and now, I think I'll prove more entertaining to watch y'all fend for yourselves. <laughs> what do you mean? The exhibits for the second hall of the auction are all stored in the room over there. <laughs> According to the information that I was sent to Heiyue, there's a bomb, so to speak, among those eyes. I recommend you confirm it for yourselves. Adios. Okay, I can enter first and then save. I'll do that. I'll, I'll get us to that lovely cliffhanger. Hey, wait! How is he that fast? He's so manly. I see that Yin is much of a monster as the rumors made him out to be. Yeah, he's at least as manly as I am. We should consider it a blessing from the goddess we didn't have to fight. Now, what do you intend to do, Lloyd? Time's running out. Let's conduct a sweep of the room Yin mentioned right now. I want to see whether or not this supposed bomb is really there. So you do <laughs> you never disappoint, Lloydy. <sighs> we don't have much choice. Let's investigate the room with haste! Ah. Let's go. Completely unconscious. All right, let's go in the room and then save. This room must be. What the fuck is this voice? Where they're storing the exhibits for the auction second half. There are still so many of them left in here. <laughs> Open the box first and then say okay. Only the extremely valuable things appear in the second half. We don't have much time left. Shall we split up and search? Ah. Yeah, let's do it. I have a feeling we're going to find something in here. Alright, let's see. Pile of ancient books, sort of other items. Oh, there's the box. Taxidermy endangered species. This room is covered with all sorts of famous pieces of art. Let's go, let the room get chiller. Let's go, dirty by the killer. Alright, 
still worried about the bomb Yin wanted to stir about earlier. Lloyd, are you alright? You went pale all of a sudden. It's nothing. Don't worry about me. So neither Ellie nor Wazi heard the voice. What's going on here? Start of a Valkyrie into tableware and a very of ominous masks. Majora's mask is here. Alright, let's do it. What's with this trunk? This thing is massive. What could possibly be in here? It's locked. But I might still be able to handle it. Good thing I leveled up my lockpicking skill. Lord took out a lockpick from his detective toolkit. Good <laughs> thing I learned how to use these during detective training. I broke so many lockpicks. But then I just would pickpocket them from other people. I've never guessed back then that I'd be using them in a place like this, though. Got it. Is it a person? Let's see. What? It is! Is she related to Wazi? Is this a Rosenberg Studio doll? No, I think that's a kid. I mean, no people have said they almost look alive. This is on another level. What is going on here? No, that's definitely a person. Oh wow, this animation. Onichan Dare? She really looks like she's related to Waze. Oh. Are you sure she's not Wazi's little sister? Okay, she's an art. Huh? Who are you? What? Like, look. Like, even their faces look similar. Lloyd, what's wrong? A girl. You're. What are you doing? That's true, Doors. That's true. But, like, why else would Wazi be here? Like, they, they look really similar. That's so. You might super duper why. It's like some outlaw star shit right here. I uh think it was a pretty normal reaction to finding a girl in a case. Did you get yourself stuck in there? What's your name? Wait, more importantly, where are your mom and dad? Kia. Kia Sorrento. Oh, jeez. That looks like... Are you, like, from ancient times or something? Your name looks very unusual. Are you from, like, the ancient Zamorian civilization? Or something? You look like... Th that's what that name, like, seems to... Where are you going? Where are you going? 
君の名前はキーアっていうのかキーア You don't remember anything else. でも一体誰の Who in the world are you? ねえロイド Hey Lloyd その子の格好どう考えても招待客の子には見えないんだけど Look at her clothes I find it hard to believe she's the daughter of any of the guests Ah, well, I know, I know. 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 その蓋が開かれていたら Just imagine what would have happened if that case was taken on stage and opened in front of everyone. No. Yeah. な,なるほど。You're right. えー、お兄ちゃん、ロイドって言うんだ。Your name is Lloyd? ロイド。ロイド。ロイド。Right. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, my name isn't important. Kia, do you remember anything before you were put in this suitcase? Like your home or even someone you know? I think Ren could help with this. Exactly, Tilleran. Like, are you sure she's not Wazzy's little sister? Like, long lost little sister or something. You've got to be kidding me. Still, I can't leave you in a place like this. We've got to get you out of. <laughs> How did they? Oh, this has got to be something else. This has got to be because of Yin. Damn it. Oh no! Yare, yare. Time over, みたいだね Yare, yare. It seems our time is up. <laughs> Who at the hell? Welcome, senior Sadato. And throw it seriously? Quick, check on the goods! Uh oh. Huh. Oh, Wazzy! Come on, you gotta join us! He's fast. Hello, Guffy Four is vlogging this stream. Uh, Ikea, if she's a doll, where the instructions to put it together were very complicated. <laughs> very funny voice. He's so fast. Wazzy. Wazzy. We should prepare for the worst, shouldn't we? If we stay here any longer, we'll be caught for sure. You're right. Kia, or it has to be Kitakrika. Kia, will you come with us? Kimi no koto, zetaini manorka. I promise that we'll protect you to the very end. Good 
You two, let's change to some more comfortable clothes. We'll need to be as fast as possible. Oh, but Lloyd never noticed my dress! Also, we should contact Randy and Tio. They're on standby outside. We're gonna take this girl with us and escape the mansion! Understood. It looks to me like the real party is just getting started. Alright, okay, I know if I go in that room, I'll probably get a combat. Oh, look, I'm still holding her! Oh my god! What is this? A a a Epstein, the Epstein Foundation in his uh... Let's see. Oh wow, I love that he has his own cell phone right there. Oh my god, he's a real bona fide party member! Wow, okay, so he's a healer. Okay. A reflex. Dark matter. Okay, he has dark matter. That's great. Dark matter is amazing. Up cut to oh wow, yeah, he's definitely a caster. Oh my god, I'm so psyched we have him in the party! Oh my god, you guys! Okay, so... Oh my god, next time, we are finally, after 58 trillion years, going to finish Chapter 3. <laughs> Can you believe it? After so long... Chapter 3 is going to be done. Thank you all so much for joining me today. Oh my god. Well, we've had some fun times at the auction, but it's time to escape. Hopefully we'll get uh, Randy and Tio eventually. We got lots of new years! I love the guest characters. They're amazing, seriously. Until next time, I will say so long, farewell. Uh, will you just say good night? You're all the sweetest of hearts. <laughs>